as um, you probably saw from the video title. Trying out this new uh, Skull Riders. Skull Riders. <laughs> Let me uh, just show you guys the unboxing or the unbagging as it is direct from Pakistan check out the unbagging and uh, some first impressions skull riders skull riders with the Z all right the bag within the bag skull riders does that bother anyone else that Z Oh, let's see here. All right, well, it does look like a flannel, but if you get close in here, you can see it's all mesh. Um, I, I just wanted a normal looking um, riding shirt that would be real breathable. Um, it's got some of the features like um, the CE, the Ultra Flex CE rated. Uh, I got the upgrade padding for the shoulders and the elbows, and it all seems to be, you know, this looks pretty good. Um, so it's got the, um, the, the buttons and the zipper and the snaps on the uh, collar. Snaps, I should call them, not buttons. Uh, snaps on the, snaps and a zipper on the uh, cuff as well. That's kind of interesting. Open that up and get some, oh, and there's even a little thing there. Another thing that's bothering me about this, the zipper is on the left side of the shirt. On my, my icon, the zipper is on the right. This one fits a lot better. The elbow pads are in a much better spot. On this one, the elbow pads are just flat and floppy and I paid extra for the upgraded pad set the road armor pad set and um, I would recommend I don't know I don't know what I mean like these are curved and so they kind of stay put on your elbow in this for 40 extra bucks they're the same ones as that only they're they're flat and they just they just sag to the bottom of your of your elbow but yeah so um looking at the zipper i thought oh man maybe i got sent the woman's shirt because you know the zipper is on the wrong side but now if if you look closely on the um uh, on the picture online you can even see the zipper on the left side so i don't know it's just uh it's just weird <laughs> All right, so I will say right off the bat, it's uh, definitely very breezy. Oh, a little squirrely. Especially in the arms, it's nice and breathy. Breathy. Breezy. Um, I can definitely feel the wind coming through the mesh. So that was the main reason why I got it, and it's doing that. So I guess, you know, good job. It is nice and breezy in here in this um, Skull Riders Air Mesh riding shirt. It looks like a flannel and it operates like a riding shirt. Let's get up to a little bit of speed here. Now it's getting nice and comfy. Uh, it's probably like, I don't know, upper 80s out here. It's really humid. It's the swamp in the summer, almost summer. And yeah, this feels great. It said it advertises like that it feels just like riding with a t-shirt. I don't know about all that, but definitely a big difference over my my icon. Wow, the police are out tonight. What is the speed limit here? 35, 40? Something like that. Uh, so yeah, just to reiterate some of the things that I wasn't so stoked about. Uh, the length of this is kind of weird. It kind of reminds me of when you buy something off of um, 
Amazon and it doesn't fit the way you expect it to it's kind of like that and I don't know why it doesn't say this on the uh, website or anything but I was under the impression that this was uh, like an American made product I don't know why I thought it was American made it's not it may have shipped from Pakistan unless they made it here shipped it to Pakistan and then shipped it to Louisiana it was kind of interesting to watch the package progress though from um, it bounced around in Pakistan for a few minutes uh, and then it went to Bahrain and then to Leipzig Germany I probably pronounced that that wrong sorry to my German friends um, and then to Kenner Louisiana skull riders how do you guys feel about that Z being on the end of riders seems a little all right I'm gonna I'm just, I'm just gonna say uh, I don't like the name it almost prevented me from buying it but it's just so hot and I want to stay uh, at least as free from road rash as I can and this seems to be pretty um, I, I do think the fabric seems high quality I don't have anything to base that on I hope I don't ever find out how well it will protect me from road rash yeah this is this is nice this is nice and breezy so I don't know about all the other shortcomings of this uh, thing but but the air does come through it very adequately uh, and I bet if you're doing you know 60 70 on the highway it would be uh, nice and comfy stuff hey motorcycle wave I love it I think I am getting a little better at riding I, I don't want to get too cocky I know that's when a lot of uh, problems happen people start thinking oh look how good I am at riding and then crash rock'em sock'em robots so I'll just be careful euphorbia I really want to go there I think that's the kava place I really like to check that place out never gone and just got crunk off a of kava before you know just gonna do a little cruise here um, and hopefully we'll get to check out these night settings a little bit once uh, on the right home it'll get a little darker uh, I'm gonna try to make shorter videos on Wednesdays and l do my long form ones that I my very self-indulgent long form <laughs> videos the statistics show me you watch three or four minutes of but I'm having fun so uh, I know I know there's a couple people that just leave them on in the background probably uh, and that's cool there's not gonna be a quiz or anything like that the other day I made a video where I talked about seeing a guy pull a gun on a guy and it was at this light Oh, easy with the clutch, Dave. <laughs> that is... <laughs> I don't usually do stuff like that, but eh, it's good fun. At least I'm not squidding. I mean, I'm, I'm wearing khakis, so... <laughs> the gap uh, makes really protective... Uh... You're right. I just have regular boots on and khakis. Ah, the trolley. Look at that. New Orleans. New Orleans magic right there. I love the trolley. Please don't pull out in front of me. Thank you very much. Oh, yeah. Feel the breeze. I'm going way too fast. All right. Sorry. <laughs> way too fast for this particular road. And this road is so bumpy. There's no little, there's just railroad tracks. Jeez Louise, huh? All right, I know that this bump right here usually gets me every freaking time. I was determined not to let it happen uh, this time. But there's just no, oh shit. There's just no avoiding bumps altogether. Look at that red sky at night. Sailor's delight. 
I used to be a sailor. It's like a true thing. I was in the Coast Guard. I am a Coast Guard veteran. Determined veteran, what's up? Not that you watch this. Um, yeah, I'm a vet. I'm a veteran. I served my country. What's up? It's cool. It's good. Met my wife in the Coast Guard. She outranked me in the Coast Guard. Now she outranks me at home. Thanks, babe. If you guys have any ideas for New Orleans stuff that you'd like to see, uh, let me know. Let me know what kind of content you'd be interested in seeing. Uh, any video ideas. Uh, or I'll just steal them all from Restless Meal. <laughs> I know it's different. I know. No, I'm not judging your writing. Son of a gun. No, it's been good fun getting to, uh, you know, um, sort of interact with some other YouTubers. Uh, Spite even commented on a comment that I left for him. Who are your favorite moto vloggers, everybody out there? In moto vlog land. My favorite ones are probably um, Shade Tree, Spite. Um, as far as the bigger ones go, uh, Fort Nine, Her Two Wheels, Doodle on a Motorcycle, um, who else is good? Who am I missing? Determined Veteran, it's pretty good. Adam Sandoval is thing going to all the Harley shops, that's pretty entertaining. The blockhead Moto. So many good ones. Restless Mule. He's right up there with all those guys. He's like same level. As all those dudes. <laughs> Sorry, we're just we're both just getting started. I don't know if YouTube would ever be lucrative for me. Uh, but I'd probably just keep doing it anyway. How's this footage look? A little better than last time. It's not it's not as dark. The popos getting them keeping america safe keeping louisiana safe for my midlife moto oh, thank you for not pulling out in front of me miss you're a you're a valued member of our society and a, a fine upstanding citizen if i say so myself cruising oh this is a fun ride i think this jacket is a uh, is it a shirt or a jacket? Is it a shacket? Is it a shirt jacket? Shirt jack. It's a shirt jack. This is a fun ride, and I think part of it is because the air just goes right through this thing. Oh man, some more cops. Let's see what's happening, guys. Woohoo! Okay, that car didn't want to go, so I'll go. Thanks, guys. And there, I must be trying to hit some quota. Better watch my speed. Oh, I'm speeding at 45. Hells to the ass. Mm, hells to the nos. I don't know what you're doing. Oh, he's just driving with his blinker on. What kind of it? I better watch my speed though. There are some police. right there uh, don't don't mind me I'm not doing anything awesome for you know this would be fun thing to have to cruise out grab a drink but you know I'm a teetotaler when it comes to the motorcycle I don't even drink one beer and drive the motorcycle never have can't say I'd never drink one and go hop on the bike you know I might I don't know. I don't, I'm not a fortune teller. I'm so like conditioned to think that motorcycles are dangerous. I don't know. I'd probably have a beer. I'm probably about to have a beer. 
I'll tell you what, drinking and driving esta no bueno. <laughs> Donde esta la biblioteca? Um, but woo, <clears throat> drinking and editing video now there is a pastime. <clears throat> drinking and editing video now there is a pastime. How's this footage looking? I hope it's good. Initial impressions of this jacket. Eh, it's all right. For the money, I think it was like <sighs> almost 200 bucks. I just bought the most meshiest looking thing I could find. So if I had to do it again, would I buy this, this shirt? Mm, I don't know, maybe not. I'm just take my 200 bucks to the uh, cycle gear place and uh, see what they got. These shifts? Who taught this guy how to shift? Alright. Well, this has been mid my mid 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 my midlife review of Skull Riders Air Rider Mesh. If you're looking for a mesh jacket of all the ones you could buy, this is one of them. Uh, thanks again for everybody liking and subscribing and watching. And uh, I'll see everybody on Sunday.